A four-year-old is hospitalized after being shot inside a barber shop. That little boy was inside with his dad when an argument broke out and the bullet started flying. And as that father frantically, frantically rushed him to the hospital, he ended up crashing his car. Sunday night, I'm Walter Perez. The big story in Action News is the search for the gunman who opened fire inside a local business, leaving a little boy severely injured. There were several other children with their parents inside the barber shop when the gunman opened fire, but it was the four-year-old who suffered the most serious injuries. Action News reporter Brianna Gallagher live from police headquarters with details. Brianna. Yeah, Walter, the first day of school for Philadelphia is tomorrow and police say this barber shop. It was packed with kids waiting to get a haircut for that first day. Police say that's when shots rang out and one of those bullets struck the four year old. One of the mothers was so traumatized that she said there's no way that her children are going to be able to go to school tomorrow, given what they just experienced. It was around 515 when police say a man walked into a barber shop on the 5000 block of Rising Sun Avenue in Olney. Tomorrow is the first day of school. Many parents were bringing their children in to, for haircuts. Officials say the man walked to the back where an argument unfolded. Then out came a gun. I mean, I can say we heard it. I heard pow, pow. So I'm like, was that what? Wait, what? And then we saw things unfold. Police say shots rang out in the barber shop, one striking the four year old in the shoulder. Police say the dad was on his way to the hospital with his son when they got into an accident at 13th and Grange. Of the vehicle that was struck after learning what was happening, volunteered to take the father and the child to the nearest hospital. This woman heard the crash and witnessed the kindness of a stranger that unfolded next. I seen when that gentleman took the kids and put them in the white car and then they all drove off. Total stranger just jumped out of his car to then, you know, help this guy. Right, out. that he actually hit. I, he must have hit. That must have been the accident, the boom that I heard. She knows firsthand what it's like dealing with gun violence in the city. I lost my only son and I'm raising his grandson, my, his son, my son's child who, you know, I'm raising now. So it's hard line. Now, police say it's unclear who the argument was with and what sparked it. Authorities say that four year old is stable. We're live outside of police headquarters. Brianna Gallagher, Channel 6 Action News. Walter. Okay, Brianna, thank you.